One thinks of beekeeping as keeping bees, but instead of being kept, these are being prepared for export. Four days after the queen lays her eggs, the youngsters, or larvae, hatch out, and here's a bee baby, one and a half days old. Two and a half days later, and almost grown up in six days. On the seventh day, a new queen gnaws a hole in the cell cover and creeps out into the hive, ready to assume her important duties. If she finds other queen cells, she destroys them. They are prospective rivals. Artificial queen cells are made by dipping a wet peg in melted wax. They are then provided with gland juice from natural queen cells, and the one and a half day old larvae are transferred from the hive. The same development goes on as in the natural cells. The wee she bees grow up almost while you wait, and each cell soon houses a queen, and they can be handled by those who know how without any risk of being stung. The queens are on their best behavior. When the queen travels abroad, she takes her palace with her. Inside are two cakes of wax to receive her eggs and she's given a number of attendants for the journey. After all, what is to be, will be.